Hey all, Russ here, our beer TV. Welcome. Check it out. We're running around Ely, Nevada. Wasn't that downtown area kind of cool? The old car show. Well, it's getting close about noon. We're going to go check out. There's a big railroad museum. There's a sign for it. I think it's Northern Nevada Railroad. Every single building here is just old. <laughs> Still being used, though. Good thing. They built them good back then, huh? Ooh, there it is. There's the train station. Got the big old water tank up there. It's supposed to be pretty cool. Read a little bit about it. Can get in, see the trains up close. Let me get parked. Nice warm day here in Nevada. Actually hot heat waves everywhere. Monsoon storms. It's been quite a summer. And they do get rain here. It pours rain. Nevada Northern, what I say, Northern Nevada. National Historic Landmark, East Ely. Old brick, this has been restored. I'm sure everything has. Museum entrance, admission, tickets, gift shop. Next, you got train rides. One sold out. It's okay, we're just going to walk it today. Oh, look at this. Dirt and DJ. <laughs> I bet kids here just have a blast riding on that train. There's the old passenger cars with names, Ely, Ruth, probably town names, huh? Only 10 bucks to get in. Here's their waiting room. Got all the luggage piled up. <laughs> old wood chairs. Safety everywhere. They talk you through quite a bit of safety when they you buy your ticket. All right, let's head outside. Okay, there's actually trains running through here. Big engine machine shop. We'll get to see. Uh, one of the engines running, according to the nice lady inside. Green grass, love the green grass. Welcome to Ely, loneliest road in America. We're traveling that next video. Get ready, buckle up. We're out of here. Gonna take that road. I drove it six years ago. It was really cool. But I kind of fast-tracked it those years ago, too. This time we're going to explore it a little bit. This is where all the freight got loaded on the cars, huh? Oh, they got a big... Uh, train engine down there running. Imagine the history. All the people and freight and everything that came through here. Oh man.
they tell you you can actually drive down here if you don't want to walk it. It's like two blocks, but small blocks. I need the exercise anyway. I sit in that van too much. What's this one? Bus garage. Everything's been painted. They definitely uh, upkeep this place. Shows a water tower, some old cars, old dump truck. Here's their maintenance building. Look what they got running. Look at the smoke coming out of that thing. That's a coal burner there. <laughs> they are burning some coal. Heating up the boilers. Everything's black here. Look at the black soot from all the coal. <laughs> But you can get access. We can even go in a mechanic shop. There's an entrance for it. Wow, look at that thing, huh? What a noise box. Goodness. All the windows are black from the smoke. Brick, ground. Yeah, they're getting that thing fired up to take it out. Well, let's go down to the entrance of their mechanic building here. This looks like, what is it? Office and warehouse. For all the mechanics still being used. What's this? Machine shop and engine house. Been here forever. Even the architecture, everything. Still being used. Well, you ready? Maybe they'll put us to work. They might hand us a wrench if we go in here. Well, can't climb on anything. Wow, look at this. <laughs> Holy moly. This is a true machine shop. They probably got to make their own parts. You can't buy them. Big old high ceilings. There's an old welder. Bring your lunch pail with you to work. Huge lathe. They got pits underneath the engine. My goodness, number 93. Talk about access, this is cool. I'd like to see that thing coming down the tracks, huh? They're all different now. All electric, and diesel. Little stories on each engine. Look at the big hoods. So they can run them inside. They can capture the smoke.
Well, I bet it's cold to work in here in the winter. Wrecking crane. Look at this monster. <laughs> wow. Now, there's some engineering right there. Look at this thing. That could pick up a house. That's what size engine you put in one. I like the colors. But those hoods up there, that's they just run them inside. And things just pump out all their smoke. Those are coal, too. <laughs> you know, actually it's pretty clean in here for what they do. Look at that crane. My goodness. <laughs> And they got a little story on each engine. That one's gone. And here's the one they got outside. Them things that plow through the hills, huh? Number 81. The Phoenix. This is definitely worth it. If you drive through Ely, spend the night or whatever, you got to come down and see this. I don't know anywhere else in, you could ever see anything like this. Ever. I know I sure haven't. I've been to a few places. But look at this old coal burner. It's getting all steamed up. They're going to take it out. You could not sneak around at night in this thing, huh? <laughs> Pretty darn cool. the end of it down here we'll head back we got another museum to see yet we're gonna go to another one one last look at this monster Nevada Northern they all wear their caps railroad caps with the bib overalls covered in soot all the coal. Goodness. That was cool. Make you feel like a kid again. Alright, let's head back down. Look at that. That engine followed me. They're going to put coal in it. He backed down the track. They're going to load some coal on him. When you say fill it up, it's by the scoop. <laughs> Wonder how many miles per scoop. Yeah, you don't ever see this. Burning coal for a steaming. Look at all the people. I mean, this is an active uh, place. 
employees, safety. This is the real deal. <clears throat> Nevada Northern Railway. There's number 81. Engineer in there watching his gauges. This little town of Ely, Nevada, they got just about everything and anything. Museums. Really cool railroad one. Small town. This is small town Nevada right here. Green grass. Big farms. You know, there ain't too many towns around here. They're few and far between. My goodness. What a cool, cool place. Oh, look at the trails. Probably off-road trails. All right, all aboard. Next stop, White Pines Museum. Pretty close to downtown. All right, right down the road. Get the phone fired up. I gotta grab fuel. But tomorrow morning we're hitting the uh, loneliest road in America. Highway 50, the Lincoln Highway, clear across northern Nevada. Here it is, up here on the right, it's past the pizza place, White Pines Museum. Let me get parked. Here it is. Look at this, they even got a Lincoln Highway marker right there. Well, what do you say? Let's go in, explore it. Here we go. Ely history right here. A lot of these artifacts and pieces have been donated through the years. Almost all of it came from here, according to the guy. It was cheap, like seven bucks here. Old bottles. Coca-Cola machine. You gotta love these old museums. Here they got the newspaper articles. Same post office for a hundred years. <laughs> Photos of everything. Pony Express mail. There you go. Came through here. Well, the railroads connected. I mean, everything. Nevada. Tons of history. Wow. 
Wow, the hotel caught on fire. There's Old Town right there. It's what it used to look like. Huh. Old trophies. Stuff about the veterans, clothing they used to wear. My goodness. They've collected a lot here. This is really well done. I go to a lot of museums. This is a huge effort to put this stuff together like this and keep it. World War One. All forgotten now, huh? Yeah, looks like you get a picture taken there. Here you go. Old box camera. When I was six years old, I had one of those. Right up there, just like that. My dad gave me one. Huh. Memories on that. What else we got? They got some stuff outside. Whoa! <laughs> oh. A skeleton of a short faced bear? Huh. Wow, that thing's scary looking, huh? That's a bear. That's really well done. That's. Huh. Short face bear in eastern Nevada. There you go. Oh boy. Horse drawn hearse. All the carving on it. Wow. This is incredible. If you want to know about Ely, here it is. Through all the generations. Another mural. This town has some really well done. Very, very good artwork. It's almost like Shangri-La here. Old mining cart. Hey, hey, there's that RV or TV van again. Right next to Lincoln Highway Marker. <laughs> Those markers are cool. We should be seeing more of them when we head across the state. White Pine Public Museum. Get here and see this. Well, it looks like they hauled in some old buildings, set them up. Station Master. Cherry Creek Depot. Thank goodness they saved this stuff. More old luggage. It's 
stuff's ancient. Old typewriters, office setup, telegraph, old time social media right there. Kind of like coming back to grandma's house, huh? Old stuffy furniture. They've really got a lot of collection here. Heater. There you go. Play a tune on the organ. Old time kitchen. Ice box. Wooden high chair. <laughs> and a washboard, of course. But wait, there's more. That wagon seen its day. Rough riding thing. They got some buildings out back here. All kinds of old mining equipment. Schoolhouse, one room schoolhouse, here you go. From Baker, Nevada. Building was donated. Huh. Wow. Really looks more better on the inside than does the out. School books. And the desk. Old time piano. What's this one? The Gilbert Cabin. Ed Gilbert. Deputy Sheriff. And he was killed in the line of duty. Wow. Wow, look at this thing. Who shot Edwin Gilbert's killer? Boy, I bet that was uh, big news back then. There's the family. Old oil lamps. This is cool. Really big part of Ely history here. Who shot the sheriff? I like that song. Huh? <laughs> Absolutely incredible. got a gift shop in here. I mean, this place is just stuffful. Absolutely stuffful of uh, local history here. Anything and everything you can think of, which is very, very cool. Those were two really cool museums, between the railroad and this one. It's 
small town Nevada right here. Even got the flowers. They're still blooming. Aren't those pretty? All right, I gotta get rested up. We got a long drive starting in the morning. Next video, we're on the loneliest highway in America. Journey continues. Talk soon.